Welcome back. It's time for At Home with the Woodhams family, Stephanie, Ava, and Lily from Milpitas, California. They have a special request, I understand. Good morning, guys. How are you? Good morning. We're great. Yeah. All right, we're taking requests right now. What's the request? Uh, our grandparents really enjoy your show, and uh, they watch it every day and tell us about it. So. And we were, so we would really love if you could say hi to them, to our grandma and grandpa. Well, thank you all for watching. We appreciate it. So you're in California. I'm so curious. I spend so much time there. I've not been there in a few weeks, but what is it like right now? What's the air quality like right now, Stephanie? It's wonderful right now. Is we'll it? never take blue sky for granted again. Yeah. Uh, we were really fortunate with the wildfires not to um, have to evacuate, although we were ready for it. But um, the air quality is moderate to healthy. So you are teaching virtually. Is that how you're doing it? Yes. How is that going? I have spoken with a lot of teachers in L.A. who say that they're struggling with the teching and the IT of it all. So I feel like I have that down. Maybe <laughs> my students would be a little bit like, uh, maybe not as what else, but um, I'm so proud of how our district has adapted. Um, I love my, my, my uh, ch kids' teachers, and then my students, I feel, have really adapted as well. I'm just really proud of all the effort they put into it. You know, we're in a pandemic, and the wildfires, in our first week of school, we had earthquakes, wow. um, wildfires, we had power outages. So it's been a, an interesting year. It's been challenging. Ava and Lily, are you all taking virtual classes as well? Yeah. yeah. And you like, I know she likes your teachers, do you? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, Lily, you were silent. Oh, I do like my Okay, teachers. all right, <laughs> just, just checking. Stephanie, what do you teach? History, eighth grade. And do you have to teach all subjects? Uh, just history, thankfully. Just, just history. What's in the lesson plan this week or next week? Uh, today they are working on an all men created equal project where we're looking at the Constitution and comparing what's happening in the past for certain identity groups with the tech. We need more teacher Stephanie's around the country, don't we? How have you been keeping busy as a family? Ava, she enjoys writing a lot. And before, um, the shelter in place order. She had already written a book and she's currently working on a second one. Who's written a book? Eva. You've written, a, you've written you're in your second book? Yeah. Well, hold on for a second. What are your books about? Uh, my first book is about a girl, well, <clears throat> is about a girl who saves her school from an alien invasion with the help of her friends. And <laughs> uh, my second book is about a female spy. And how do you come up with the ideas? Uh, they just come to me. <laughs> That's amazing. Great to meet you. I'm glad you're doing well. And I think, it, you know, it, it strikes me when you say we should appreciate every day of blue sky. It's such an important thing to do, those small things in life, right? Stephanie, yeah. Ava, Lily, take care of yourselves, all right? Thank you. Bye. Great talking to you. Bye, guys. We'll be right back here on Live.